my friends Jean-Serge Gagnon here so today we're going back to basics we're talking about course income secrets and what is course income secrets and how can it help you to generate income online you know one of the things that I talk about in course income secrets is all sorts of different things and maybe you're wondering what is this all about why is it all all these different things and we're going to talk about that we're going to talk about why I don't have my shirt on why my hair is not done we're going to talk about all of that in just a minute but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets so you might be wondering what is going on what's going on with his hair what's going on with his shirt why does he look also like all oh, not even shaved what is going on and what is course income secrets anyways right maybe you've been seeing different episodes you've been seeing episodes about wordpress you've been seeing episodes about uh click ecourse the host uh the course hosting platform you've been seeing um episodes about mindset you've been seeing episodes about creating a course you've been seeing episodes about Twitter about LinkedIn about TikTok about Instagram about all sorts of different topics that don't seem to be really connected and you're wondering how does this all work and how is that going to help me generate income you know because one of the things I say in that intro is that course income secrets is to help you generate income with the e-learning boom that's happening right now right and if you look online if you look at any of the top leaders you're going to see that they have digital assets if you will right so those are like courses or things that they've put together that they're making available for people to actually uh make to to buy so that they can generate some income right and before we get into all that and what is course income secrets and why it's a mishmash of all sorts of things let me answer the the question that's on your mind right now what's wrong with my hair what's wrong with my beard why do I just have this t-shirt on instead of my normal shirt and the reason is because today is labor day and it's a day off and I did lots of work outside I've actually been working on a little trail in my forest I don't know if you've seen that I do that on my story sometimes I talk about the little trail I'm doing in the forest I also am working on we replaced a door a couple of weeks a week or two ago we replaced an outside door because the floor was was not really it was starting to rot so we replaced that and we also put in a brand new um outside door and now I'm kind of finishing it off you know f uh, f uh, fixing the I don't know what you call it the part that's around the door that connects between you know the walls and the door and then you got to put some finishing on there you got to and I'm also painting the deck and there's all sorts of work that I've done all day today and you know the plan wasn't was to do my video the episode on time as usual in the morning and you know instead it's the evening now and I'm getting ready for bed almost and I just thought you know what I'm gonna do my episode right now and I'm gonna talk about course income secrets just because that's something that I haven't really talked about that much trying to explain to you what exactly is course income secrets and you might you might be following me maybe you're not following me maybe this is the first time you see me and you're you're seeing anyways if you if you go back you'll see this is episode number 200 and what is it 217 um actually I'm I have it right here 217 it is episode 217 it's episode 217 of course income secrets and you can actually go to cis217.jsgagnon.com cis217.jsgagnon.com to go see my my blog post on it and you can go find the uh the, if you're listening to this in an audio obviously you can go look at the video to see what I actually look like when I'm talking about you can go find that either on YouTube on Facebook on LinkedIn all the social media platforms and this is part of what course income secrets is about so the first thing that is important to build to to, to generate income online if you want to make money online right you gotta be you gotta have something to sell and you got to have an audience that's interested in buying it 
right so those two things having something to sell uh doesn't have to be yours you don't have to create something you can actually use uh, PLR programs you can use uh, referral programs affiliate programs <laughs> all those kinds of things there's a ton of different um, options out there if you don't have a product to sell you can sell network marketing you can you can anyways there, like I said there's tons of options and that's one of the things we do in course income secrets we talk about the different things you can sell so that's why we talk about PLR programs that's why we talk about affiliate programs that's why we talk about uh promoting somebody else's course we talk about promoting at platforms we talk about all the ways that you can generate income without you having to create anything so you can do all that and that's one of the things we do in course income secrets just talk about all those things you can do right so that's that's you have to have something to sell now if you if you don't if you don't have an audience if you don't have people you can offer something to you're not going to make any sales right so that's the other thing that you need absolutely 100 there's no way around it is you need an audience to sell to now if you have tons of money you can go and create Facebook ads you can go uh, LinkedIn ads YouTube ads Google ads um, Twitter ads uh, Instagram ads whatever right you can create ads and spend money to to present whatever it is you got to sell to your audience there's really good ways to target properly to make sure that you know the people that are that you present the ad to that see the ad are actually interested in what you got all those things but that costs money right so with course income secrets we certainly talk about ads sometimes and putting together pixels and creating ads and and what it is that you uh can you know uh what it is that you can do to generate sales by doing advertising right we talk about those things not always let me just I gotta do something over here um let's just uh, get this uh, computer quiet there we go okay so I mean we talk about that right we talk about ads we talk about but then there's the other way of generating sales and income from having a fan base all right having a fan base is about having likes on a Facebook page having followers on Instagram having followers on link or connections on LinkedIn having followers on TikTok I mean all the platforms have different ways of growing your followers right your fans your followers and we talk about that those things too so you know for example we I did lots of episodes on TikTok a while back and if you go to my blog you can actually search for TikTok you'll see a whole bunch of blog posts for, about TikTok about growing your TikTok about creating TikTok content about things that I tried and the results of it those kinds of things and why do I talk about those things why do I talk about TikTok why do I talk about LinkedIn and growing your LinkedIn connections why do I talk about Facebook and, and how engagement is important because all those things are are the ways you generate free followers free um audiences right free fans and that's one of the ways that you're going to get to get sales you got to have fans you got to have followers you got to have people and just having those is not enough unfortunately and that's another thing we talk about in course income secrets we talk about how to build engagement how to create um engagement where people will actually see your post because you can post on Facebook I, I post on Facebook I'm not very active so I'm not getting lots of engagements and that's because because I'm not engaging so and, uh, and that's one of the things we talk about we talk about <laughs> we talk about how you have to engage so that you or your so the platform will show your stuff so that the people will see your stuff so that they'll start to engage and comment on your stuff right if you don't act, create activity if you don't do things if you don't um take action then the platform knows and the platform isn't gonna show your stuff even though you post 10 times a day it doesn't matter right but I mean that depends on the platform right so we talk that's why we talk about Facebook we talk about LinkedIn we talk about TikTok we talk talk about Instagram we talk about oh my god all the uh, everything we talk about everything and I know it sounds overwhelming but the 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 the, the premise or if you will the 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 plan is that with course income secrets over time if you 
watch the episodes regularly or maybe just a couple times a week or something and you just pick and choose some of the things you're interested in you're going to learn things that will grow your understanding of all of this right because you know I can, we can talk about building your engagement on Facebook and you know I know how to do that I'm not doing it right now because I've got other priorities I've got other other things I'm working on but I know that and I did it I did it for a whole week to just prove that that's still the case is basically if you're posting on Facebook here's an, okay we'll just give you an example Facebook here right so if you're posting on Facebook you're posting about your business you're posting about your um about your product you're selling or you're just posting about your life just pictures of your kids pictures of your wife whatever right well you're not going to get anybody seeing anybody if nobody's commenting on your stuff it's not because their stuff's no not good your stuff is awesome it doesn't it has nothing to do with that it's because you're not engaging on other people's stuff and Facebook knows that you're not active the Facebook knows the, the platform the algorithm knows that you're not b engaging on other people's stuff you're not liking other people's stuff you're not commenting on other people's stuff you're not sharing other people's stuff you're not active because you're not active what happens is that the platform Facebook in this case will not even show your stuff to people the only way that people will see your stuff is that they go to your profile and they go look at whatever you just posted that day right so you might get some engagement if you have really really good fans or you know family people that really love you that really want to see what you're about they might go to your page go to your profile and actually see your stuff and actually like and comment there right but the thing is that in the social media world especially Facebook right now because Facebook has been around for so long they you know in all in all honesty they have to be they have to organize stuff they can't be showing everything to everybody there's too many people on there so they have to kind of make decisions for you uh, on what to show other people so they're not going to show things to other people from people that don't do anything <laughs> right so if you're just posting and not doing anything else they're going to be like oh well that person is not engaging he's not active they're not doing what they're supposed to do so we're not going to share their stuff but as soon as you start to engage and like I said I did that for a week I I spent 10 or maybe even 30 minutes a day 10 minute blocks here and there right during the day and going through my timeline clicking on things looking at things commenting on things going to my friends actual profiles and going straight to their profile and looking at some going to my friends friends the ones that are my friends when you see when you go to somebody's profile right you see their friends you see the friends in common you can go to their friends so you kind of follow other people and not just what's on your timeline so I did that for a whole week and the difference was insane how much more I would get engagement whenever I posted something so the first day I posted something I might get like five comments or five likes but after the week when I would post something I would get like 50 likes and maybe 30 comments which you know isn't like thousands but it's still a huge difference from the beginning of the week to the end of the week now some might argue well that's because whatever you posted was better and all that well you know what maybe maybe it was a bit better I don't know that's hard to say right but the point is that if nobody sees your stuff in the timeline in the news feed then nobody's going to comment on it but as soon as somebody sees it and they like it and comment it then Facebook says oh this is actually a good post I'm actually going to share it more so they share it more and this, so it's a kind of a chicken and the egg thing or a, or a snowball effect right so what happens is who when you post something and you're being an engaging person on Facebook you're doing things they'll share your thing and then because they're sharing it there's people that are going to see it since somebody out of the people that see it are going to comment on it and the reason because Facebook actually there's even something even more crazy about Facebook is that they know or they they have a good feeling of who would actually comment on whatever you're posting so they know who likes pictures of, of families who likes pictures of of kids they know who likes pictures of, of dogs they know who likes uh, promotions of products they know who likes you know whatever it is they can they get a good idea of what your picture is or what it's about 
and then they know who to show it to isn't it insane but that's how it works and that's how it works with the other social media platforms there's some variations but it's very similar but if you look at uh, platforms like TikTok that are relatively new or even Pinterest where you're posting videos on Pinterest that's relatively new if you do that you're taking advantage of the platform's newness or the new features of it and you're going to get lots more engagement and lots more people seeing your stuff and potentially going to your blog or buying your stuff or whatever it is right but that's the thing so you have to be you have to be doing what the platform wants you to do okay so that's what course income secrets is about when we talk about the platforms that's because we're talking about growing your fans and growing your uh, views of your stuff right so you know as well as I do that if you want to make a sale you got to show that product to more people right now I'm not saying and this is another thing we talk about in course income secrets we talk about you not spamming we don't spam don't don't share your product don't share your company those things you don't want to do and there there's people that are like well why I don't want to hide that I'm in with whatever company I'm with or those kinds of things right and the thing is that <laughs> if you start sharing your product first of all people will know that you're just there to sell things or at least they're going to think that and they're probably right because you know that's really what we want right we want to make money we want to generate income we want to be able to quit our jobs we want to be able to you know uh travel and do all sorts of things right and we need money for that so yeah we want to sell things and people but people don't want that they don't want to know that even though it's kind of obvious that everybody wants that people don't want to be bugged about that they don't want to feel that that's all you care about they want to know that you care about them <laughs> so that's why you have to be posting other stuff you can't be posting about your products company and all this because people will see that all you care about or they'll think that all you care about is making sales right and maybe you do but at the same time you're not going to make any sales if that's all you care about that's just the laws the laws of the universe if you will you can't make sales if that's all you want <laughs> it just won't work so you got to build a fan base and how do you do that well you learn all the different little things but you got to be engaging you got to be building relationships you got to be using reciprocity you got to be using uh, uh you got to be relatable people have to want to know you they have to like you they have to trust you before they buy anything that's another thing we talk about in course income secrets and how to get people to know like and trust you you know what what is this personal branding attraction marketing stuff we talk about those things too and like I said it's overwhelming there's so much stuff so you can't learn it all you gotta just just take a little bite of it take a little bite that's what we do in course income secrets we we show you little bites a little bite of this a little bite of that and maybe they don't seem connected but over time you're actually going to realize how everything is connected to this income generation process it's not going to happen overnight and you know I don't want to burst your bubble if somebody told you you're going to be a millionaire in 90 days then go talk to them because you know I can't convince you otherwise but I I can tell you that that's not going to happen and you know maybe you'll find some amazing thing and you'll get this amazing income and results and everything but I'm I don't think it lasts although again I might be wrong maybe there's some people out there that have made the millions and they kept the millions and but I don't know it's not somebody that I that I wouldn't want to connect with because I feel that I want to know their struggles I want to know somebody who had struggles because I'm I have struggles so I want to be connected with somebody who has those struggles right you, 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 it's just there's just so much to learn to build your business online you know attraction marketing personal branding the social media platforms the 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 process of engaging the process of building rapport with people and becoming somebody they they know like and trust how do you do that right how do you create blog posts how do you set up a blog site how do you you know create a course how do you where do you host a course how do you how do you put it online how do you get people to buy it 
how do you get people to even see your course and and be interested in looking at it it's not by just posting a link and saying hey go check this out that that's not going to work so you learn we teach you how to how to grow a fan base that knows likes and trusts you that's what that's why we use personal branding that's why I use personal branding that's why I'm building me my brand that's why I talk about sometimes about my family or I show you videos on my snapchat instagram or or, or facebook stories where I show what's going on in my you know and in, in, in around there right so I mean like I'm building this little uh, trail in the forest there and I'm replacing a door there's things you know I have a normal life there's other things going on in our lives we go to the beach on the weekends we have great great drives it's a we went up on a on a on a lighthouse that was kind of cool we didn't even know about that we went to this place called Panmure Island here in Prince of Rhode Island it was an awesome day we went there we went up to the lighthouse we didn't even know we could and we we went there then we went to the beach there we took a drive around looked around it's pretty normal right the life is normal you know I have a day job so I work every day Monday to Friday right and I want to get out of that I want to get out of that day job I want to stop having to tell my boss like tomorrow morning is the first day of school for the girls so we're taking them to the school and I'm going to go in the morning and I have to tell my boss I'm going to say hey I'm going to be away for an hour or so I'm going to start late whatever I got to tell my boss like I don't want to have a boss that's one of the things I'm trying to build towards right is getting rid of that in my life so that I can be free and that's why I'm building a personal brand and that's why I'm using attraction marketing so that you get to know like and trust me hopefully right if you don't like me well first of all if you don't know me you're never going to like me you have to know me to be able to decide whether you like me right and that's what personal branding is all about that's one of the things we talk about in course income secrets we talk about growing your personal brand so what is personal branding personal branding is talking about you and being a being you being yourself you know letting people see your messy hair letting people see your unshaven unshaven self you're just in a t-shirt whatever see you whatever you are that's me on the weekend doing some work on the house doing renovation work right so I'm not I didn't put gel in my hair I didn't shave I didn't shave so I mean that's me so I'm being me right so that you get to know who I am so that's personal branding and that's the first step in personal branding so that get people get to know who you are right so they got to know you before they maybe like you so if you get to know me right you're following my Instagram or my Facebook or whatever and you start to get to know me you're like oh this is cool this dude has you know two daughters he's got he's got the house he's got uh he's building this thing in the forest he's got this garden he likes plants he likes this he does that right and you're like oh I like this guy or maybe you don't like me that's fine you don't have to like me if you don't like me I'm okay with that not everybody's gonna like me I'm not a person for everybody that's for sure and if you don't like me and you don't follow me then that's okay but if you do like me then you might start to trust me and that's the point of personal branding so you get personal branding is to grow who they so grow your brand so people get to know you right and the only reason you want them to know you is so that they can decide whether they like you and once they like you and they follow you more eventually they're going to trust you that's how you get to the sale because people don't buy from people they don't know like and trust they buy from people they trust and for them to trust you they gotta like you if they're not gonna trust somebody they don't like people don't trust anybody they don't like right and they won't like somebody they don't know if they don't know you they can't like you so it's a it's a it's basically a, a straight line no like trust right that's how it works they gotta know you then they'll know they'll like you and then they'll trust you if they know if they don't if they know you and they don't like you they're not going to go to the trust they're not going to trust so it's okay so you gotta just whoever likes you is going to eventually trust you if they see you often enough if they don't see you often enough and that's the other part of personal branding is you got to be consistent you got to be persistent you got to be creating content regularly 
and that's the other thing we talk about in course income secrets is the core the content creation my my personal content creation plan right is I create a video every day or mo most days mon well Monday to Friday right now I create that video then I upload that video to YouTube I create a blog post then I tie that video to that blog post and then I create a five minute version of that video with an outro on it that says this has been part of course income secrets if you want to listen to the rest of this episode go to my blog and you know that's kind of what it is so you get a five minute one so I share that five minute one on Facebook on LinkedIn uh, on Twitter and on Pinterest so I share that five minute video there and then I also share audios I share an audio the full length audio on SoundCloud which also goes to iTunes and I share the five minute version of the audio on Alexa um Alexa uh well you know, the the Amazon Amazon Echo Alexa right the Alexa app it's a skill and Amazon Alexa skill is a five second five minute one so again the same thing it's just all the content I share it in all those platforms and I do all that within about half an hour to one hour per day and that's but how do I do that how did I get to a point where I could do that it took me a long time to get to a point where I was able to do all that because it does take time if you were to if you were to record like me I record a 30 minute video pretty much 30 to sometimes 25 sometimes 35 minutes right I record a video and that video is half an hour right just half an hour to record it so if it takes me another half hour to to do all the rest then it's an hour and that's kind of what I do during my lunch time right so I do that and then then there's I'd still need maybe 15 minutes to write the blog post and that's about it right so it's an hour an hour and a half is how long it takes me to do all that to record the video create the blog post and share it everywhere right and that's one of the things that 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 you need to be doing I'm not saying you have to do all that what I'm saying is you got to be sharing content regularly on the platform you can choose one platform you can just say I'm just going to be on Facebook just Facebook I'm going to master Facebook I'm going to learn all the skills about engagement on Facebook about how to how to connect with people how to send the messages when to send them a friend request all these things I'm going to learn all these things and and then once that works then I'm going to start to make sales and you know what you could you certainly can do that and that's one of the things you should do if you're starting out you definitely don't, don't want to be doing like me and going everywhere right you want to start somewhere <clears throat> and it can be Facebook can be LinkedIn can be Twitter can be Instagram whatever platform you like best even you know TikTok even Snapchat you can still use all those platforms and learn the best way to connect on those platforms it really depends on your what is it you're trying to sell what is your income you're trying to generate and uh, yeah so that's what course income secrets is all about it's all about these different things and that's why it seems so overwhelming and you know you can't you can't learn everything in a day um I've tried it doesn't work you can't do that I remember when I first started it was like okay uh in 90 days you're gonna be making sales you're gonna be growing your audience you're gonna be building you know building a business right and I was disappointed because it's been five years and I'm just now starting to grow starting to get sales starting to get you know and I'm not saying it's going to take you that long it really depends on how much time you have what else is going on in your life right maybe you don't have a wife and kids and maybe you don't have any other things that you have to do in your in your normal day-to-day -day life right you maybe you have maybe you're single maybe you you can spend you know 20 hours uh 40 hours a week on part-time thing maybe you don't even have a job that would be awesome maybe you're a student and you have lots of time I'm just saying it depends everybody's different and just keep that in mind but the point is course income secrets is about all those things put together in like a melting pot of ideas so you don't have to worry about uh, going through all of them just just start listening to them once in a while just go and listen to them you can learn different things every single time you listen to one and you can go to the to the blog and go look at the different episodes and go back in time and go through them all that's okay you can do that too 
so that's what course income secrets is about I hope that that explained some of it and if you have any other questions of course you can go ahead and reach out send a put a comment below make sure you you know subscribe and like the page and all this all the good stuff and we'll see you in the next episode this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon, until next time.